Is there a limit to mankind's progress? Is there an inherent boundary to the growth of the human population, as there is with all animal species? Or are human beings different? If we are different than animals in this way and have the potential for unlimited growth, what does that imply about what should be valued in economics? or how we relate to other nations, about the value of the human individual. How must we today think and act to ensure a future for mankind over the next decades, the next centuries? Croft Erica, the German-American space pioneer, was convinced and proved that mankind is a fundamentally different and higher kind of creature than animal life. This Friday, March 24th, marks his 100th birthday. And in celebration, LaRouche Pack is commencing a week of dedication to Croft Erica's mission and his work as a crucial intervention into our campaign to make LaRouche's four laws to save the U.S. economy the policy of the new administration. Were we to rekindle Erica's belief that man's mind is the source of unlimited potential progress, not bound to the limitations of this one planet alone, the United States, in cooperation with China's One Belt, One Road, could welcome a completely new era of progress for all mankind. In our week-long celebration of Croft Erica, LaRouche Pack will post writings and video lectures by Erica on man's future as an extraterrestrial species, along with crucial works by Lyndon LaRouche, including his 1988 broadcast, The Woman on Mars. We'll feature Erica's collaboration with Lyndon and Helga LaRouche and their common fight for a new renaissance for mankind as against the limits to growth ideology. Stay in touch with us daily this week as we discuss Croft Erica in our three live broadcast shows, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and host a national discussion Thursday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. The New Paradigm Show on Wednesday will cover his work on the industrialization and colonization of the moon, the first step in the extraterrestrialization of man. The show will be streamed live at 8 p.m. Eastern and we encourage you to ask questions via YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. We look forward to your participation. We lost internationally, from Germany all the way through across the Atlantic, we lost something that was precious. And that was Kraft Erika himself. The support, the memory, of what he has done for the nation and for the world.